Let me show you how you can remove a page from your website which is showing a Google search result. You might need to remove this page because of a different reason. It might be a personal information showing on that page, a confidential page, or it can be any reason. And let me show you the process, super easy process, how you can remove pages from Google search result. You can see this is Google search engine. If I search my website, you can type site colon and then your website domain name. And you can see all the pages of your website will be shown here. For example, if I go to second page here, you can see there is a page here only for coffee lovers quiz. So I created this page for a tutorial and then I forgot to remove this page and now it's already listed on Google. So I'll copy the URL of this page. Then I go back to Google search console account and then from here left side, you will see indexing and then click on removals. So here you can see we have this option temporary removals. We need this option for even temporary and for permanent removals. Let me show how you can do. So you click on new request here and now you need to paste the URL which you want to remove from Google. If it's just this page, you can use this option, remove this URL only, or you can see if there are multiple pages. For example, if you have a category which says, for example, coffee, and there are so many other pages inside it, what you can do, you can add that URL here and use remove all URLs with this prefix. But in this video, we're just going to remove the single URL. So I'm going to paste this URL here and then choose remove this URL only. Then click on next. And then you can see it says this URL will be removed from Google search result for about six months. And if you want, you can always cancel this thing. So because it's possible that you don't want to remove this page permanently, just for some time you want to remove this page and click on submit request. And now you can see process requested. With time, this process will complete and the page will be removed. And now the really interesting part comes. Okay, so this was the temporary removal. Now we need to address the reason and the cause why we removed this page from Google search result. So this page is created by mistake on my website. So I want to remove this permanently. So we have removed from Google Search Console, but now we need to remove this page from our website also. So now you need to go back to website backend. And for example, this was the page. Okay. If it is a permanent removal, you don't want this page ever to show again. You can just choose the page and delete the page. You can send, if you're using WordPress, you can move to trash and then apply. So this page is gone. So what will happen? So we did this removal for six months. When the next time after six months, Google will come to crawl this page. They will say, okay, they don't find this page on your website. So it is automatically permanently removed. But in case you think that this page right now, you don't want to index, but maybe in future you might need this page, but you want to keep it away from Google. So in that case, what you can do, you can go back to your post. For example, this was the coffee lovers. Then you can click on edit. Okay. So if the page we might use in future and right now we don't want it to be indexed. So what we can do. We can go to the page, we edit the page and then if you're using Rank Math, Yoast SEO, every plugin has this option. Click on the relevant plugin and then, for example, Rank Math, this page I can set it to no index. What happened when we will set it no index page and then click on save. Now, once, for example, after six months, this page still exists on my website, but because I set the no index tag here and click on save. So now Google, again, when they crawl this page, they will say they should not index this page in search result. And later, if you want, I can remove the no index text from here and I can later index this page. But if you permanently want to remove this page, submit the request there like I shown you and then delete the page altogether from your website. I hope this video helped you out. If this video helped you out, don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel. I create so many important video tutorials which helps you to elevate your SEO to have the better website, better blogging and so many important tips and tricks. And subscribing is totally free. I would really appreciate that. If you want to rank your website number on Google search result, check this video screen. And if you want to watch an amazing complete tutorial on Google Search Console, check this other video on screen.